Roller Coaster and Theme Park fans, welcome to Roller Coaster Airtime. In this video, we're visiting Kings Island and bringing you our thoughts, visuals, and vibes from the park in 2020 during the COVID season. If you're new to this channel and you like roller coasters, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now. Now let's get going. Gotta go get our ticket, our, our Ryan ride ticket. First things first. Yeah, these are identical tracks. You see one goes, like the blue train goes that way, the red train comes over here. One used to be set up facing forward and one was facing backwards. First ride of the day. Red car number three. We just got off Racer. We were in uh, the first car, third row. Kind of learned that you don't want to be right underneath, right underneath the uh, rear wheel. You feel like all the jarring just from that wheel, but it's still a really good ride. First one. It's always fun, especially on the racer. Found a new tip. On these wooden roller coasters, if you pull yourself up and just let yourself, don't let your back touch the back seat, or the back of the seat, like the backrest, you'll get a much smoother ride. Especially if you're in a seat that's over a wheel. Yeah, like uh, one of the seats that's over top of the wheel is super uncomfortable, super bouncy. But if you like pull your back up off the backrest, then... It takes a lot of the vibration away. We got two lines converging to one, trying to stay six feet apart here. There's supposed to be some clues all over the place in here. just got off of Ryan for the first time today. What are your initial thoughts? Oh my goodness, it was great. I had so much air time today. It was a lot of fun today. We just came back from Cedar Point last week and I think I liked it better than Millennium Force today. I hate to say it, but yeah, I think I did. What about you? Oh, I don't want to say. Okay, we'll ride it again some other time. We'll let you know. So we got off of Ryan and we're kind of thinking maybe last time we liked Diamondback better and we just had a really good ride on Orion so we're going straight to Diamondback here so it's fresh in our mind and settle this once for once and for all what's our favorite ride in the park Fourteen. 
sounds great. All right, just got off Diamondback, trying to decide if Diamondback's still our favorite ride in the park or if it's Orion. I personally think I liked Orion better today. I thought the drop was better. Um, Diamondback is noticeably longer, but Orion was just fun. I'm, I'm the opposite. I, um, I still have Diamondback as my number one and Orion number two. Love both rides. <laughs> This is the path to Mystic Timbers. Just a little circle path. <laughs> Mystic Timbers might have something to say about who's the best ride in the park. <laughs> Remember last last yeah, last time we were here, we th we kind of thought Mystic Timbers kind of might have been one or two. Yeah. yeah. Those tracks are burr. Yeah. We just got off the beast and it really is scary. Like it's legitimately beats you up. It's scary. We had a really good ride on it, in my opinion. Did you like it? Yes. The tunnels are terrifying. Yeah, it was pretty good. You better hold on though. I don't put my hands up during the second drop of the second tunnel. It's uh pretty intense. Thinking about the type of mask you're going to wear is kind of uh, becoming a thing now. You've got to be comfortable but breathable. You can't use the ski masks. You know what they call this part of the park? Tony Mall. It's like supposed to be the old part of the park. The old arcade in there. already know. You already know. We're getting on the drop tower. really short and it still took 45 minutes. Yeah. I want to know, has anybody ever rode Flight of Fear and not waited like more than half an hour? Crazy. That does it for Kings Island. 
My yeah. first ride on Orion was my favorite of the day. Yeah, I, I would say that's my favorite of today too. But it's not your favorite ride. But it's not my favorite ride here. Oh well. <laughs> we got 11 rides in the day. Pretty good. Um, we're happy about it. So we're gonna head home.